After a 59-yard punt, the Badgers start from their nine-yard line. A running play in first down and whacked in the backfield is Zach Brown by Chris Lewis. A little bit different than the first play for Wisconsin last week, an 80-yard touchdown pass as you look at the starting lineups up top. Bunch of punts over the years. Blocked a punt against Wisconsin last year and a field goal. This time, a great punt as Wiley is backed up, fielding it inside the 10, gets a huge block and crosses the 25. Still inbounds all the way out to the 41. The Badger coaches said they were scared of this guy, Devin Wiley, because of the speed. He also got a great block and out near the 40-yard line. 10 Paul Broom with a quick throw wide open is Marlon Moore. Big cushion by the corner, Aaron Henry, and it's a first down for Fresno State. It's like Chris just mentioned, you know, they're playing a deep zone. It's third and five. That's like a gimme. Oh, it's too easy. Go to Hawaii and then and in Cincinnati in between there. Colburn on second down. Again, look at that cushion. West with the catch. And he gets an extra five or six yards, pushing past the marker for another first down. Well, this is a good job by Jeff Grady, offensive coordinator from Fresno State, recognizing the cover three zone. And Henry's doing his job. Aaron Henry's doing his job. He's got deep as the deepest. He's playing that cushion. Now, here's where he does not do his job. You come up and, and tackle, you don't grab the man and kind of drag him down. You better come up with some bad intentions and put your face through the football and drive your feet. That's how you eliminate yards after catch. Offensive guys hate to hear that. Yeah. <laughs> bad, bad intentions. Yeah. <laughs> I notice how you move closer to me. Yeah. I said that. I'm just coming over near you. He's getting fired up. First down inside the 15. And West makes the catch and is in. Right on cue. As Wisconsin's defense continues to give that huge cushion to the Fresno State receivers and they pay for it. Well, he spread them out, as uh, Chris said. Empty set, receivers all the way across, just a little slant route. Pick your poison, you know, just pick whatever guy's open. You know, this they were open all the way down the field. And a double slant, you had three guys jump the first inside cut of the slant, leaving the second guy outside with room to work. Chaston Wedge catches, catch a ball, ball on a run. Result, six plus one. And Gessling's extra point makes it seven nothing Fresno State. He made a 52 yarder earlier in his career. Has the distance, but it's no good. Wide to the right. So for three. Can't give away points. One. <laughs> Holborn to throw on first down. Going to go deep, as you guys said he might. Wiley is there. Inside the 20. Touchdown, Fresno State. You guys called that on the last drive yeah. that that would be the adjustment and there it was Devin Smith got toasted. It's punch counter punch punch counter punch. Wiley was the guy that brought fear into Brett Bielema. Take a look. First of all there's a little double move outside release and it's just speed on speed. What happens is the corner looks back for the football and Devin Smith and as he looks back Wiley just gains ground Bob throw up the air ball let him run under it. Go celebrate. He was up there and jamming, bump and run, just ran around him. Wiley's only 5'7, five, 5'9, five, and 170 pounds. So he's a midget with a lot of speed. And a 70 yard touchdown catch. I've seen him have some big, play, uh, big plays on special teams already in this game. Here's one of the better young running backs in the nation. True freshman Robbie Rouse into Wisconsin territory to the 47 yard line. Don't forget about the running game for Fresno State. We've been talking about the wide receivers. Look at the blocking up front. Big 79 is at Cunningham, the left guard. We're talking to um, Brett Bielema yesterday, and he mentioned Bernardi, the center, and Jackson, the right guard, as two of the best offensive linemen he's seen in a while. No. Colburn looking for Wiley all the way and finds him across the middle inside the 30 yard line for a gain of about 15. That time the corner Finellis on that side was up in press coverage and still Wiley got a little slant route on him. 
Take a look at the protection. Colburn's looking right all the way, and that started with a bump and run. Finellas just let him inside. Can't. Play clock at two. Colburn got it off, going end zone, got a man, touchdown. Say he is zero to two, wide open for the Fresno State score. It's too easy. Antonio Fidel has started out in the press, backed off. Watch him starting in the press. You see him backing off. He's going to run it in and and out. Take a look. There's the inside move. Fidel jumps on it and just pitch and catch for Jira. 2 2 for six. Kevin Gessling was shaken up earlier. Back on to try the point after, and it is 21 7. Fresno State pretty good on third down so far. Wiley with a catch and breaks a tackle in midfield. And Wiley has just killed the Wisconsin defense today. They've got they've got big play people, explosive people on the outside and in the backfield. I'm impressed with the quarterback, Cole Byrne. How well so that doesn't happen. Tolzien gonna get sacked. Chris Carter right around Josh Oglesby, the right tackle. Back at the 40-yard line, loss of about six or seven. We talked about Carter earlier in the game, the little small defensive end, 230 pounds, is outweighed 100 pounds. Number 43, Ogilvy outweighs him 100 pounds, and he just runs around him. I don't think Ogilvy ever touched him. Oh, and his brothers Rick and Jeep grew up in this area, running play. On first down, nowhere to go. Eric Smith, true freshman. And Moses Harris was all over. And the safety that Harris, the strong safety, just came up and showed an eighth man in the box, and that's exactly where they ran the ball. Colburn pump, lobbing it for Azira 2-2. What a throw. Put that thing right on the money to the Wisconsin 45-yard line. Double move. They double moved him. We talked about that was a sluggo. What a sluggo is, show him, Bob, a little slant. There's your slant. And let's put the go on it. The go. Brickley did a good job of taking away the inside. Yeah, and uh, Ashira Tutu did a nice job of making sure he caught the ball. He was, was underthrown. He knew he was going to get hit. And on the first play after the missed field goal by Gessling, play with the touchdown run. Broken tackle. Ashira Tutu, tough to bring down. Eventually stopped at the 46 in Wisconsin territory. All timeout. Second and seven for the Badgers. And Tolzien on the keeper, tackled at the five. Interesting play called there. And now it goes from second and seven to third and 11. Inside 40 seconds now. First down. Inside handoff, Matthews. All the way to the 24. And now they can get up there and spike the ball. Well, you got the clock stopped at first down, so you can go ahead and run another play. Uh, look, last year, three against Wisconsin. This will be a 41-yard attempt. wonder what his confidence level is, knowing the history of the Wisconsin kicks. Gessling to try to tie the game from 41. Had a boy. Nailed it. And we're even at 24 apiece with 16 seconds to go in the fourth quarter. Not that, not that you're cheering for Fresno State or anything, but you, it's good for the kid who struggled sure. against Wisconsin, comes back and makes one for the team. Good mechanics, snap, hold, and the Bob Greasy drive right down the fairway. Colburn pumps. Again, the pass underthrown. This time caught by Moore for a Fresno State first down at the 10-yard line. Wisconsin's trying to play man to man. That was open with Azir Tutu, the pre two previous plays. Now they come back to Marlon Moore working on Brinkley, and Brinkley got caught up. You're going to take a look at Brinkley right here. He's almost going to lose his balance. If he falls down, see him right there? He's kind of in his back pedal, almost lost his balance. If he falls down, Marlon Moore gives this Fresno State team a chance to tie it with the extra point. The Colburn pumped it, and then he came back. I, I like this kid, Colburn. He's really. Cool under fire. From the seven yard line. Colburn looking for his year at two. What a grab! Touchdown, Fresno State. It's all day. What a terrific catch 
by the six foot four inch Sei Ajira Tutu being covered by Chris Maragos. Yeah, again, it's the height matchup, and he's your best receiver in the red zone. So we sit there and mark it because we know that's where he's looking. Soon's a snap, and this is a great job, Bob. His guy is six four. Maragos is six foot. Go to the back of the end zone. The quarterback has to go throw it as high as he can. Kicking into that student section, no problem. Right down the heart to tie it at 31. We'll go to a second overtime in Madison.